Oh, didn't see you there. So we're back at we're back again for furnace line. Well, is furnace line falling into sea part two? But uh, so we we thought we start in the same position again. So here, last time we were looking around some big diggers, and uh, I think there was a dolly, like a, ra a a rail dolly, and a few other bits. But now this is the the aftermath after um, of all the machinery and all the stuff to be new. Look, and there's all mud everywhere, and I don't think. I don't think golf club's going to be too happy because uh, they've all dug all their grass up. But look at all this mud. Look, it's all, all the wet season, all the Cumbrian wet season's made everything dead muddy and this is all big trucks. And I think a lot of this is from today, what I'm going to show you. Today they've been ripping up the metal road today and I'm going to show you that. And I think this is a lot to do with that. So uh, come with me. So we've uh, come onto the uh, onto the north side of uh, the sea wall. Oh, that's our side up there, and um, our side and our side viaducts up there just at the end. And uh, this is the very start of the sea wall on this side. And as you can see, I think I think it's uh, proper spray concrete. It's called something, isn't it? Spray concrete. And I can't think what it's called. So uh, the it's called something, but some bags over there, and I'll see what it's called. But it is called something because they do it in tunnels. If there's a tunnel falling down, like a, a river going through a, an old, like, I don't know, 1800s tunnel, they spray it with this concrete to, to make it strong. And I know the word, and I'll write it in here and tell you what it is. But this is what they've cleaned it out and sprayed it on here, and that's all the way along. And as you can see, it's only the top half. They haven't done the bottom half, and I don't know if that's because. Is it because the sea comes in and it's going to destroy the bottom or are they coming back later to do it? I don't I don't really know what they're doing there. Um, but uh, we'll see. We'll walk down and see what they've done a bit further down because some of it's a bit lower, but all of it's still got the grass on the bottom. But uh, we'll go and have a look. It, uh, it looks like it's called a uh, fixed traffic. What's well, um, like a spray concrete? So we were right. So they were spraying it on the rocks and you know, the sea wall. So uh, that's what it is, and it's uh, it's made in Afa stone, and it was manufactured this year. So it's brand new concrete. And uh, down here, there's some old brushes, metal brushes off that machine. I showed you in part one where it's on a on a digger. There's a big box with brushes in what they use to clean the uh, sea wall. And these are some some old ones. Look, they've all gone rusty with the the salt. And they've got these little. Uh, that's where they all fastened in the top. One of these metal strands is fastened in here. Looks really cool. It looks like money, but it isn't. It's uh, it's all the metal strands. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna walk down here, but. It's not like when we first came. When we first come, this was all nice and shiny and brand new. And now it's like a quad mire, so we'll have to walk down the grass, I think. Because I'm not going to walk through that. So uh, we're at the end of the road. This big metal road ends here from today because they've been ripping it up today. Big truck's been down and uh, 
the, the steel, uh, the metal roadway guys and big scanners with uh, an IAB on the back have been pulling them up today. So look, this is, it's all gone and it's just left the, uh, the, the pattern of the uh, metal roadways and you can see all the dead grass underneath. But I tell you what, what have they done here? Because they've only done like, what's that? Six foot of the top. It's, it gets smaller as you go down. So I, I, I think they should ask for the money back because they haven't done a lot. You know, they've only done a bit. I thought they were going to do like a six month job of like loads of men and ripping all this off. And they've done what, two months of that? And that's it. And even the top wall they haven't done much with. I thought they were going to repoint it and you know, rip all this out, all this grass and redo this and reseat a load of stones and blah, 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 a load of stuff. But uh, they haven't done it. So I don't know what the, don't know what the thing is. But if anyone knows, let us know. Drop, drop a comment below. Or anyone who's network rail, what what are you doing? I'll store back rail. We're on the other side now towards going up to Grange and uh, they've put a bit of road down but not a lot. But as you can see they've started on the wall here. They've actually power washed the wall and started from this end and they've had a, someone down here with a, wee, a strimmer and they cut all the all this uh, brush down and they've cleaned this and look here looks like a castle now that could be a, that could be a camelot that could you know it could be a knight on top of that i've always looked at that and wondered what it was has it had a signal on top of it or something or a board i don't know what it's part of the railway it's quite a nice feature and obviously they've power washed all that and i think they started come with me i think they've actually started pointing this yeah, they have, look, they've actually, you know, stopped it cumbering down, so they've actually started it, and I think they've done a bit there. They haven't done the bottom yet, they've just power washed it and cleaned it off. But today, it looks like, because I was here the other day and this wasn't here, they've had, it looks like they've had a digger down it, the track looks like a telehandler or something, and it looks like it's got stuck, <laughs> and they've had to come back, so I think they might be putting a road down here if, uh, if it's a bit boggy. So, uh so yeah, look, they've been down here, so I don't know what they've been doing with a telehandler down here, maybe he's had, oh, they've done more, more pointing down here of the rocks, and uh, they've pruned all this, and I think, maybe this, because this digger's been down here today, but it's more of a telehandler more than a digger, I think they're going to rip this out, this big tree, because uh, obviously that's going to affect the seawall quite a lot, because, you know, all those roots will be growing underneath the railway, or growing underneath the... Uh, the uh, sea wall and effectively uh, making it crumble because it's moving it uh, so obviously they might be ripping that out because they've cut the top off it uh, but we'll see on that I'll do an update on that see what happens uh, but it's uh, it's wet because uh, oh and there's a it looks like a a long five six coming coming uh, south to, uh, to south to uh, Lancaster so uh Oh, there was only one guy masked up on that. Oh, the rest of it was uh, was empty. But I've, yet, I've, I've noticed recently, since the lockdown, it, through the lockdown, we had a lot of 195s, and that's the all they ran on this line. But since that sort of lifted a bit, they've, you started using 156s and 153s again. So uh, it's interesting. Uh, and all this, look, this is... Because this is, we've, had, we've had a few high tides, but we've more had Lake District rain. So it's... Uh, made this all very soft and he looks like he's got stuck so i wonder if he got pulled out that would be good i should have come down and had a look really it's pretty cool look at that all these look all these big chunks off his tire wow it's pretty cool that uh unless something else is down here and he pulled it out like a trailer maybe something like that i don't know uh, but we're going to walk up there and I'm going to show you um, a bit of a platform near the signal that I've always wondered about. And I'm going to show you what they've done with the power washing and everything. And as you can see on this side, it's going dark very quick so we have to speed it up. But as you can see, they've done the same on this side where they haven't done the bottom of the wall. It's still covered in moss. They've only done the top and power washed it. Uh, so uh, I'll go and show you anyway. So 
So, uh, as you can just see then, they've put these, it looks like they uh, rolled up tarp, but it actually isn't, it's all the way down there. It's all that cement again, what, you know, that spray cement. So they're just placing it ready to do this wall. Because uh, obviously on this side, they haven't got a metal road, so it's not easily accessible. So they just have to put them where they put them, really. I hope they don't get washed away. I hope there's no high tides. But anyway, I was talking before, this signal here, uh, for north, going up to Barrow, next to it has uh, these four posts. Uh, and I think, it, I think it used to have a little platform on it. I don't know what it was for. I don't know if it was for maintenance for the signal or it was just, I don't know, they had something on it. But these four posts have obviously just posts now and then they've got no, um, no top on it. But since he's power washed it, he's power washed the posts and it's took all the, um, uh, what, what's he call it? Um, uh, the creosote out of it, that's the word. And it's come back to uh, uh, natural wood. So it's really interesting that. I'd like to try and find a picture of a platform similar or maybe this one and show you what it used to look like. Uh, but if anyone knows what that used to be, comment below. Because I'd like to know. Um, but yeah, and they've done the wall here. They've power washed. Now I've got a picture of what I can actually plonk in here where I, I watched them power wash it. A guy with a big lance power washing it and another guy sat with the trailer with a big tank and the jenny on it and then he had a pipe ran right down there and he had a, a guy i think he was called universal water tanks and he was in a big scanner with a, a tanker on the back and he was pumping water from him all the way up here to do this wall um and they obviously get they're getting ready now to spray concrete into it um but it's the same again they haven't done the bottom of the wall i don't know what's going on you now they're only doing the top of the wall. Because you would have thought the bottom of the wall, that's the main structure, the, the, you know, the base of the wall. You would have thought that would be the weakest point, but I don't know. Maybe they're going to come back and do it, I think. So uh, it's going dark, though. So uh, I'll, uh, we'll have to sign off at some point and do an end. Uh, but we'll go a bit further up and uh, I'll see. So uh, thank you for coming along and uh, seeing uh, furnace line, is furnace line falling and see part two. And I've sh I've sh I think I've shown you everything, but uh, we'll have to come back and do a part three eventually, maybe when they finish. But thank you for coming along and seeing what I see, really. It's always nice to have you with us. But remember to uh, subscribe, uh, like, comment. You've got to comment. You've got to comment about today. Maybe tell us things and whatever. And uh, click that big bell. Ding!